guys welcome to dar es salaam the biggest city in tanzania and as you all know with the rapidly growing population of a city traffic congestion is always a problem but for a city like dar es salaam the implementation of the dar es salaam bus rapid transit system has provided efficient commuting and curbed traffic congestion this rapid transit system began its operations on 10th may 2016 in dar es salaam buses are keeping the seaside city on the move and lots of these buses operate daily and they have their own lane to avoid traffic uh these buses have replaced most of the dollar dollar that were initially used hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel it's your girl chero still in dar es salaam let me tell you guys this place is very hot it's very hot anyway so in today's video i wanted to try out the bus rapid trans uh, these buses that are uh, bus transit system here in Dar es Salaam and uh, I've seen people try it and uh, it's a very good experience and I also wanted to try it and then and show you and tell you how my experience was I hope you guys enjoy this video okay so and I hope you're enjoying my Dar es Salaam video so please subscribe 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 you guys enjoy Dar es Salaam for you okay this is how this I just love their roads by the way I love their roads and I love how everybody's busy over here I haven't seen people uh, just idling around like everybody's busy 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 yeah so yeah so guys this is where you bought this these are the buses you see this one's the ones running here this one's and this is where you bought it from you bought the buses from this is like one station yeah you see this is how it looks like let me try it out and tell, tell you how my experience looks like so guys let's go and board the, the bus ramp, rapid transit uh, they are locally known as Mundokasi yeah so let me go board and uh, go to the city centre I'm going to the to the Magomeni Mapipa bus station. Yeah. So guys, okay, the place of entrance is the other side. So yeah, I have to go to the other side to pay. Oof. Anyway, guys, this place is so hot. Yeah, it's very hot. It's uh, the temperatures are like that of Mombasa. Hey, it's the bus. You see the other one? The blue one. The long blue bus. Yeah. That is it. They are locally known as Mwendokas buses. Yeah. And people are inside. Here, let's go and pay. So guys, we got the ticket to the city center at 7.50 Tanzanian shillings. Yeah. So this is how inside looks like. I've been told I have to go up to the far end to get the bus that goes to the city center. Okay, guys, yeah. I really love this, uh, how uh, this bus transit system is. Yeah. So let's try, let's try this together, okay? Let's do this. So we have, like, that's the bus. system has made transportation in Dar es Salaam effective and due to huge commuter demand the system is expanding yeah
They say locally window kasi means it has speed. So and it's the cheapest means of transport I've seen here. Yesterday I was using a motorbike and uh, motorbikes are expensive here. Yeah, that's that's what I can say. So yeah, I'm in uh, a place known as Kidukoni. Yeah, so the Indian Ocean here. You can see the ships and all that. Yeah, so let me just stroll and then I'll be back. So guys, here it is. The Mwendo Akasi station. Yeah. So, and this is Dar Salaam for you. And we have the Indian Ocean. You can see the Indian Ocean from here. Guys, the bus stop is just here. Uh, they have their own land, that's why they go like uh, they are called Biokasi. And then you have to be very careful so that the bus doesn't. Uh, doesn't stop over at the place where you where you are not going so they usually they usually indicate on the bus where the bus is going specifically even inside the bus station there's an indication of where you are supposed to board the bus from so yeah but it's a very nice initiative by the way it really helps yeah So guys, 
guys i noticed in the evening that the buses are usually extremely busy and the station is fully packed as you can see from the from the video when i entered the station there were so many people there were so many students at the station and this was around 5 pm this is because this is the time when people are coming out of their workplace to go home students are also coming out of school to go home and uh, you will find yourself waiting for some period of time for the for you to catch the bus this is because many of the buses coming uh, especially from the city center are usually fully packed so you have to at least wait for some time for the bus to to come and pick you up or for an empty bus to come and pick you up but all in all be sure you will not arrive home late because once the buses pick you up they usually take less time to arrive at your the morning hours the buses and the station is also usually busy this is because uh, people are going to work in the morning and students are going to school but all in all this is the fastest means of transport in Dar es Salaam it is safe it's reliable and affordable to all users and I really love how systematic and efficient their operations are so I just love the bus rapid transit system in Dar es Salaam and I hope whenever you are in Tanzania you can get to try out this bus rapid transit system so guys I've tried the bus in the evening and let me tell you I couldn't even record like it's because people are coming out of work so there are so many people and uh, yeah, and but yeah, uh, it's the fastest means of transport here in Dar es Salaam. Yes. Coming from the city center, it's very hectic. It's very hectic. And uh, but now going to the city center, the the, the uh, bus empty. But coming from the city center, it's very full. You can stay there for a very long time.